Hi Java developers, in this video we will learn how to install Tomcat 7 in your Windows machine. So let's first of all go to the overview of uh, Tomcat and then we will start the process. Actually there are two ways of downloading Tomcat server. The first is via setup file and second via zip file. So actually this is a short series on top Tomcat uh, divided into three videos. This is the first video in which I will explain Tomcat server uh, installation via setup file. And in second video, I will explain the directory structure and few troubleshooting ways in Tomcat. And in third video, we will learn uh, installing Tomcat server via zip. So let's begin with the series. Go to Tomcat website and download setup file for the Tomcat server. This is the Tomcat website. I will ping this link in the description box. Let's scroll down and you will see this hyperlink 32 bit 64 bit window service installer. Let's click on this and this will download one exe for me. Go to show in folder and yes, this is the exe for Tomcat. Uh, right click on this and run as administrator. It's a good practice. Now it's asking me to allow this app, so click yes. Alright, so welcome to Apache Tomcat setup. Click next. This is the agreement. Click I agree. And to use full of Tomcat, uh, select full. This will check all this uh, checkboxes and click next. All right. This is the advantage of uh, installing Tomcat uh, through setup file. Like we can set this port number, username, password on our own. The main reason is this Tomcat server by default port number is 8080, which is same for the Oracle. This might give you issue sometime. Uh, when 8080 port number is busy with some other services. So let's change it to something else like 6060 and let service name be Tomcat 9. It's okay. Username, any name you can set, but I will go for admin and also password as admin because it's easy to remember. Click next. This will pick up my mm, by default JDK. I have JDK 14.0 installed in this machine. If you want to learn how to install JDK, do check this card on your right. Now click next. It's asking me for the location on which I want to install this Tomcat. Let's not uh, install on C drive. Uh, let's change this drive to drive T. It's always a good practice because C drive is sometime read only. Okay, let's create new folder here with name server. Okay. D drive server. Let's click install. This will hardly take 10 to 20 seconds and the process will be done. Okay, great. And check this. I don't want to read readme file or run Apache server. I want to do it manually. And check this and click finish. Let's go to the server folder which we created. Okay, you don't have currently. This is a typical Windows thing. Just click continue. All right. Here are all the files, all the necessary files I need to run Tomcat. This is the main file bin in which you will see this tomcat9.exe. Just right click this and again run as administrator because it's a good practice. Click yes. And yeah. All right, we can see server set up in 1577 milliseconds. So it's our Tomcat is up. Okay. 
if you want to see the current home page of this uh, Tomcat and uh, double check yes our installation works perfectly go to your favorite browser open new tab and uh, type http colon slash slash localhost and whatever port number you assign while installing so I assign 6060 so hit enter and we can see yes if you are seeing this you have successfully installed Tomcat congratulations so very crisp and clear so that's all in this uh, for this video in the next video I will uh, explain you these all these directory structure what are these and what are they used for and if you wonder uh, what's this new notepad this is the editor which I developed and uh, for its installation just check this card and you can easily download this on your windows machine this is only for windows machine so thank you for watching do check my next two videos on tomcat